Tom, last game of the league season on Wednesday night. Yeah, and it's going to be a tough one, I think, because Church Stoke are flying again. Um, and they've got a few people involved in the CWFA side as well, so it's going to be a challenge for us, for sure. They've gone well this season, haven't they, really? Yeah, I think, they I think they'll probably just miss out on promotion. But, um, you know, I didn't think they started off the quickest, but now they're into full stride. Um, I think they've got a couple of games to go after us. Um, and, you know, they've still got a chance, but it is an outside chance of going up. Obviously, league-wise, it would be nice to end on a high note. It would be very nice for us to end on a high note. Um, you know, it's been a tough season. We kind of knew it would be after, unfortunately, Mark resigned early doors. Um, and then it was a case of sort of getting through again. Um, obviously, delighted to have now Sean Harris coming in. I think he's going to be here tomorrow night as well. So it'd be good to have him here to have a look and see what he's got and what he thinks he needs to bring in for next season. And in terms of his involvement, is that like to be active or just watching? Hopefully active. I haven't really spoke to him too much into it, um, but we'll see. He's coming in at half past six tomorrow, so we'll have a look and, it's, you know, it's his decision really. It's up to him. In terms of your squad, how are you looking? Um, we've, got, we've got numbers. Um, obviously, uh, towards the end of the season, we've had a bit of mix and matching going on with the first team and reserve team. Um, again, it's, it's come to that point where you kind of want the season over in, in a certain sense. So, you know, we'll, if we get something out to get tomorrow's game, that'd be great. We'll have a right good go at them. We'll probably go quite attacking. And, you know, if we lose 6-5 or win 6-5, it'll be a certainly exciting end of, week, end of season. It's been a struggle a bit this season, hasn't it, really, for largely because of the reasons you outlined earlier on, obviously changes to the uh, management team. Yeah, changes to management and, you know, um, getting the players. Um, it's very difficult, you know, one week you'll have 15 or 16 and next week you'll have 11 or 12. So it's it's been quite difficult, yeah. And uh, a final point then, if you could end on that high note, um, at least it, it goes away for the summer with everybody with a sort of kind of sweeter taste in their mouth, really. Absolutely, yeah, and again, okay, that would be good for Sean. Um, so again, you know, he'll have more players to pick from then, hopefully for next season. Um, obviously, we've got the Ottawa Cup semi-final next week against Hay. That'll be an interesting one for sure, and I don't know who he'll be supporting. Um, but, you know, that's a free game for us, you know, we're not expected to win that game. Um, but that'll be a good challenge.